How's it going, guys? I believe you are already familiar with how to install MB Lab in Blender. And if you are not, check out my previous procedure guide. It talks about its installation. With that being said, the next thing to do is to create your character. It has been also, it will be automatically rigged, and uh, you don't have to stress yourself about the bones or the joint locations. All what you need to do is just edit the body mass to your preferred dimension or you also edit the muzzle tone when you are done with that and if you are satisfied with how it looks then you proceed to save or you export it to a selected folder in your document and uh, it should be saved in the fbx format so that it can be recognized in the real engine uh, application okay so now that we are in on Real Engine 5, you have feel free to select whichever template you prefer. And uh, as soon as you are done with that, you click on Create. So uh, at the browser, at the content browser, you select, you select or you create a new folder. So uh, after you create the new fo folder, you can tag it. Uh, you can tag it as main, or you tag it as whichever name that uh, is okay by you that uh, you are going to be very familiar with just so that you won't confuse yourself so immediately after that you drag in the character that you created in blender with the help of the mb lab don't forget it was saved in fbx format yeah there you go uh this is your character but the only downside here is the skin texture was lost while importing but I uh, don't see that as an issue. Unreal Engine is extremely robust and uh, you can retexture it here in the Unreal Engine uh, with the help of its inbuilt component. So uh, just feel free to get yourself familiar with it and uh, from there you can continue with your project. And if you like this procedural guide, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. I can't wait to hear from you. Good luck.